Hello everybody, my name is Rebellion and today I want to show you something special for the game Ars Must Die 2. This is going to be a tutorial how to farm skulls. So the first thing that you're going to need is your weapon. I'm gonna take a stone staff. Second item that you will go is first Blue Scorcher. You, you need to buy it. Want first upgrade and first unique upgrade. Everything maxed out. Next on the list is the Paladin. You on the max health and uh, health regeneration. After that comes the Archer. Want the first upgrade fully maxed out and the first unique ability. After that you kinda can, this is optional, you can get the Guardian Trinket and Trap Reset Trinket, you're using them only for the passives. The map you are going to do this on, it's the Edge, the story one. And we are, the difficulty is Nightmare, if you do not have the Nightmare unlocked, you need to finish it on War Mage. First thing that you need to do to place three scorches facing the rift. After that you wanna place your paladin like, like so and the like his leg like barely touching the edge. In the first wave you wanna help your paladin as much as you can. But don't use your right leg, only use your left leg. And spam as much as you can. After that you wanna place your scorches like that. Do not push them all the way to the edge. Only place two here. You can fit three but place only two. After that is done you're gonna wait till you get 800 and place another scorcher like as far back as you can right now. So it's, it's in the middle. So from this point on you're gonna keep your distance because the grenadiers are like spawn. And you want, you don't wanna get damaged. The main goal is not to get damaged and not to use mana. After that you place two last scorches and that you're done with scorches at this point. You can just chill back here. Uh, sometimes ores can be thrown onto this railroad, uh, so you need to keep your eye out for them. Usually they are killed by this card, but if they are not, you just need to go here and like finish them off. Right now is the time when you place your archer. When you get your first 500, you place your archer right about here. And from this point on, you're basically done. Now you wanna add one more paladin and as many archers as you want to and able to place.
so at this point you don't need to do anything. And keep placing the archers, but like, I don't know. And I don't need to. So it should be 15 skulls right now. So it is. So I will show you why you get these 15 skulls. So as I mentioned, like you don't you don't need to use your mana. So if you don't use your mana, it's six plus skulls. If you do not get hit, it's five skulls. And this is like for perfect victory, but perfect victory means that you didn't lose your rift points and you made it in part time. So that's basically it. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, I'm a streamer on Twitch. The link will be in the description. See you on the next one. Bye bye.